Hello and welcome to LearningEngineer.com where we engineer learning for efficiency. My name is Michael Langdon and today I want to show you how you can put building blocks like the quick, quick parts under the insert tab directly into your document and how to customize the contents of that building block. Now the first thing we need to do is create our list items for our building block. So I created a list of addresses that I made up. However, you can create whole pages, paragraphs, or single items that can be inserted into a document, including images. Now that I have a list, I need to convert my list items into building blocks. To do this, I select my first address and I hit Control C to copy the whole address so that later I can paste it into the description for the building block. Once I have copied it, I then have to put it into a building block, and to do this, I press Alt F3. This brings up the Create New Building Block dialog box. box. Here I will enter a name that I can recognize. Next I want to put it into the Auto Text Gallery, but I don't want it in one of the categories already there. Instead I want to go into the Category menu and Create New Category, which I will name Addresses. In the description, I'm going to paste the address that I copied before. Once done, I now want to choose where to save it. You may have different templates for different tasks, so you have to decide for yourself how to deal with that. Finally, I need to click on the Options menu and decide if I want to insert content only, insert content into its own paragraph, or insert content into its own page. For this one, it is best to insert content into its own paragraph. Now we need to do the same thing for our other entries, making sure to put them into the proper category. Now that that is done, we can actually delete our list. To add our building block to our document, we first need the Developer tab. To see the Developer tab, click on the File tab and then on Options. In Options, click on the Customize Ribbon, ribbon item and then in the second column, check Developer and then click the OK button. Now go to the Developer tab. In the Controls section, you will find the Building Block Gallery Content Control. Place your cursor in the document where you want your list to appear. Now click on the control to insert it. Now you see it in your document. Immediately click on the Properties command. In Content Control Properties box, enter a title and then a tag. Usually they have the same name. You can also have various checkboxes that you can select depending on what you want to do. For example, you can lock your control so that it can't be deleted or edited. Almost done. Click on the gallery menu where it says Quick Parts and change that to Auto Text. And then under Category, click on the menu and select Addresses. Click on Design Mode in the Developer tab and change the text you see in the control to something like Choose an Address. Now you want to click on Design Mode again to get out of it and see your control as you will see it in the document.
Now go ahead and test it out. You can see each address in the list. I hope this helped you become more productive. I'm Michael Langdon, and thanks for watching. Please tell your friends and coworkers about Learning Engineer.